satisfaction when we're done. Satisfaction of what's to come. Ladies and gentlemen, how about a big round of applause for both these young ladies? You want to show these ladies are tough. of boxing. We go to the scorecards. Judge Kenny Sinkett scored about 98-91. Judge Lloyd Davis scored about 189. And Judge Barry Ogeron scored about 98-90. All three for your winner by unanimous decision. Friday Night Fights, presented by Miller High Life, and we've got our main event, Jolene Blackshear, Margaret Sitteroff, next on Friday Night Fights. Welcome back to Kennel, Louisiana. We are set for tonight's main event here on Friday Night Fights on ESPN2, and what a good one we have for you. We will get a look at the IFBA Flyweight Championship between Jolene Blackshear and Margaret Sitteroff. That's coming up in tonight's main event. Let's take a closer look at the combatants in what should be a very tight main event. Tonight, the IFBA Flyweight Championship is at stake. Margaret Sitteroff is from Windsor, Ontario. She has a professional record of 6-0 with three knockouts. She hasn't fought in six months, but she is a very talented young boxer who hopes to make her mark tonight on Friday Night Fights. Three knockouts in her career came early. She talked about what her skills are when she steps in the ring. Um, there are two main things that I'm usually complimented on. Um, first is my speed. I, um, I definitely, it's not just that I throw a lot of punches, I throw them, I guess, with surprise. I throw quick punches. And number two, which is the, uh, probably um, the biggest thing that I'm complimented on, is my defense. I don't just throw from my chest, throw a whole bunch of wild punches. You know, I, I protect my head also. I mean, I, I'm hope, I hope I'm fairly intelligent and I want to stay that way. Sidorov is a smart lady and she has a very distinct view of how she sees women's boxing. The, the biggest thing is I want to see female boxing recognized as a skilled sport. Um, I want to be recognized for the abilities that I have in boxing, not whether I look nice or whether I'm willing to uh, put on a sideshow of some sort. I basically want to be recognized for the hard work that I do, because I do work very hard in order to become the boxer that I am. Another hard worker is Jolene Blackshear. She's from Tish, and after a win against Anissa Zamoron in 1997, she scored a fifth round stoppage of Sarah Hall. Blackshear. Her strengths are definitely her power. She's very strong, comes at you strong, throws a lot of punches. I'm gonna have to work on my speed and my angles. Like, I, like I'm gonna wanna throw my punches and move throw my punches and move. I think Margaret's going to be a strong fighter and I believe she's going to be really quick and have fast hands and she'll move good but I'm really prepared for that and I'm just going to open up my heart and open up my body and mind and just give it everything I have and we'll see how she responds to that. Well, that is coming up in tonight's main event. Now, Teddy, we heard Layla Ali on with Brian and Max. She admits what her level is right now, but you have Joe Frazier's daughter, George Foreman's daughter, uh, Duran's daughter. I think the people that run women's boxing had better be careful because there are promoters that are trying to do it right like tonight, and then there are other promoters that are going to just try to capitalize on bucks, and they're going to make this a sideshow, and they're going to wind up doing more damage to women's boxing than actually helping the cause. And tonight in our main event, we get a look at a different level as far as the skill level is concerned. Yeah, the ones you're talking about, they're just marquee names, to be honest. They're catching in on their names and all, they're working hard, but they're just the names. These girls, as you're talking about, they paid their dues, they've had amateur background, it was available to them they got it and I'm telling you these girls know how to fight these girls are not just about show these girls actually know how to fight both Sidorov and Blackshear this is gonna be a good fight I'll, I'll put my I guarantee it okay well very good skill level and let's take a look at the women they have made their way into the ring for tonight's main event and there is Margaret Sidorov she's 26 years of age she went in at 108 pounds and she has a professional record of 6-0 and with three knockouts and she will be taking on the reigning IFBA flyweight champion, Jolene the Terminator Blackshear, 29 years of age, from California. Delilah Gonzalez, 
She won a 10 round decision. She has been in against very good competition Blackshear. She lost to Yvonne Trevino who's very talented. She had a good hard win against a very good Anissa Zamoran. She had a fifth round knockout against Sarah Hall and then that 10 round decision against Delilah Gonzalez also very good competition. To go away with aggression but Sidorov's going to be there. I'm telling you right now she's a good counter puncher. Teddy you know that Sidorov's a, a good boxing fan. When we asked her who her boxing idol is, she gave an answer that you know, makes sense, but it's not the name that would immediately come to mind. Usually you get the De La Hoyas, Roy Jones. She said Eric Morales is her favorite. you got to be a good boxing fan to know how good Eric Morales is. She was a featherweight champ of the world undefeated. Yes, you do. You're right. Blackshear are doing a really good job, too, of, you know, kind of pumping out the jab and then ripping off that right hand. Don't count out Sidorov, though. She does some real good things in there. Get that stool. Round I zip that by. Up. Remember, two minute rounds in women's boxing. Championship fights are 10 rounders. We're through two. Double that jab, baby. Double that jab. You can see Sidorov is trying to time black here now coming in. You can just see it. She's using that left hook pretty good now, Bob. Sidorov. She's looking to time time black here coming in with the right hand with her left hook. Black here throws that right hand a little too far away. Watch for Sidorov to throw that left hook on top of it. Little subtle change in the, in the round here, this round for Sidorov. Again, Sidorov looking to take advantage now of the aggression of Blackshear. She tried to nail it coming in. Well, this black shoe is a little buzzsaw, Bob. And they throw the right kind of punches. Tight, nice punches. Good step left by Cyril. Black shoe very strong. There's Bell to end round number three. You get in there, spread the jab. You better work. Speed. Keep the speed up combinations. Pace, baby. Come on, move forward. Well, Jolene Blackshear is having fun with it, Teddy. <laughs> She's got a long way to go. She's in there with a tough opponent. I told you at the beginning, this is going to be a tough fight. And it's sizing up that way. And a good fight. Come in, she kick right. I thought that Sidorov started turning around the last round. And she's going to continue doing that if she can. Yeah, she outlanded Blackshear 28-15. And she threw six more punches in the last nice round. Oh, yeah, baby. She found out she can't pose with Blackshear. Blackshear throws too much oh, leather. Yeah, she's got to move her hand and be first. Oh, yeah, and that's exactly what she's doing right there. Oh, yeah, See how she's moving her hand? She's being first.